welcome back to our vlog. So for today's video, I will be sharing some tips kung paano po kayo agad ma-approve as a course hero tutor. So recently, I was looking for a legit online job kasi I'm a full-time mom and I need to have an extra income. So kaka-search ko, nakita ko tong course hero and I tried applying as a tutor. So, that was April 27, nag-apply ako. Then, April 29, na-approve na agad ako as a course hero tutor. So, two days lang po, approved na agad. Ano ba yung mga ginawa ko para i-accept agad nila yung aking application as a tutor? By the way, kung hindi po kayo familiar with the course hero, so, ito po ay learning platform na pwede kayong mag-search or makakita ng different resources na contributed ng mga students and educators. So, kapag nagsasearch tayo sa Google, meron di bang mga nagsasuggest na mga websites? And one of those is the Course Hero. So, yung mga answers doon ay from the tutors. So, sino-sino ba yung pwede mag-apply as a tutor on Course Hero? College student and college graduate, pwede po kayong mag-apply as a tutor. Just make sure na meron kayong proof of education like your DOR and diploma. Kasi yun po yung i-attach nyo sa inyong application. Ang kagandahan kay Course Hero, hindi mo na kailangan mag-apply sa physical office or kaya ma-interview ka nila online. So, ang kailangan mo lang is isubmit yung kanilang requirements. So, ang requirements lang naman ay dalawa. Yung proof of education mo and valid ID. So, one valid ID lang. And, pwede ka na mag-proceed with your application as a tutor. So, ano nga ba yung mga ginawa ko para ma-prove ako agad as a course hero tutor ng today's lang? Meron lang po akong apat na steps. Very easy steps na ituturo sa inyo kung paano kayo mag apply as a tutor on course hero. So, yung unang step po na ginawa ko is nag-create ako ng Course Hero Tutor account. I-leave ko po sa description box yung link kung saan po kayo pwedeng mag-create ng inyong account. Pagkatapos ko pong nag-create ng account, um, pinapili ako kung ano-ano yung mga subjects na gusto kong i-tutor. So, sa Course Hero, pwede po kayo mamili hanggang 15 subjects na gusto nyong i-tutor. So, marami siyang categories doon. Merong engineering and technology, merong arts, merong philosophy, merong related to marketing, merong math, merong um, finance, merong um, foreign language, and so on. So, depende na lang po sa inyo kung anong subject yung gusto nyong i-tutor. So, kapag nakapili na po kayo ng mga subjects, yung step number 3, so ito po yung ginawa ko, kinumplete ko po yung application form. So, sa application form, itatanong niya sa'yo yung iyong name. So, first name and last name. Itatanong niya rin yung iyong um, contact number, email address. Tapos, meron doon question na ilalagay or meron siyang certain question doon na kailangan mong elaborate kung ano yung iyong profession. Kapag na-complete mo na yung application form mo, the next step is to upload your proof of education. So, again, sabi ko nga, pwede kayong mag-upload ng inyong latest transcript of records or latest grades and diploma. And then, after nun, um, i-ask naman niya kayo na mag-upload naman ng valid ID. So, sa valid ID, ina-accept nila yung government ID or kaya yung school-issued ID. So, yun yung best option ng um, IDs na pwede mong ilagay. After naman nun, kailangan mo naman mag-submit ng photo mo or picture mo na hawak-hawak mo yung valid ID na uh, sinabmit mo nung una. So, after nun, completed na yung iyong application as a course hero tutor. So, take note po, they will review your application and mag-respond sila ng 3 to 5 business days. So, here's a quick demo kung paano po kayo mag apply as a course hero tutor. So, using your phone, 
Go lang po kayo sa browser ng phone nyo and then type nyo po si coursehero.com. And then after that, create new account or sign up. So, educator and then fill up nyo po yung hinihingi ng form. Sa school issued email, okay lang po kahit hindi siya school issued email, pwede rin naman yung valid email. Make sure na valid yung email nyo and then create a strong password. After that, ikiklik nyo lang po yung button na create account. So, pag okay na po, ayan, uh, okay na yung inyong account, pwede nyo na pong i-edit yung inyong profile. So, sa edit profile, pwede nyo palitan yung username, yung school full name, and then yung type. Make sure po sa username ay unique yung username nyo. Ayan. Then, after nyo pong i-edit yung inyong basic information, pwede na po kayo mag-apply as course Hero Tutor. So, click nyo lang po si Earn and then become a tutor. So, kapag lumabas po itong file na to or itong form na to, click nyo po si Apply Now and tatanong niya kayo nung mga subjects na gusto nyo yung i-tutor. So, in my case, I am under the Engineering and Technology. Sinelect ko po yung mga um, subjects that are related to computer science. Then, I also select uh, doon sa category ng math. So, make sure lang po na you're confident sa pag-answer nung mga questions. Then, after nyo pong pumili, i-click nyo lang po yung next. And, mapupunta na po kayo dito sa form na to. So, i-ask nyo kayo ng different questions. So, fill up nyo lang po yung form. Like, again, yung first name, last name, email, contact number, and the rest. Sa part na to, kailangan nyo pong i-describe yung professional background nyo. So, kung gusto nyo ng mahaba or maiksing uh, description, okay lang po yun. Pag na-fill up nyo na po lahat ng hinihingi dito sa form na to, click nyo lang po yung submit na button. And then, mapupunta po kayo dito sa page na to. Click nyo lang po yung kanilang terms and condition. And then, click continue. So, kapag kinik nyo po yung let's begin, i-ask na po niya kayo to upload your document about your educational background. So, again, pwede po kayong mag-upload ng inyong uh, latest grade or kaya diploma. And after po niyan, i-ask na kayo to provide naman your valid ID. So, pwede government ID or school-issued ID. Kapag nasubmit nyo na yun, ang next step or yung last step is to upload a photo of you holding yung valid ID na sinabmit mo. Once okay na yon, click mo lang yung complete and then there will be a message na magpa-pop up sa sabihin na you completed your application. So you need to wait 3 to 5 business days para i-review at ma-approve yung application mo. Here's the sample questions and earnings po na nakuha ko dito sa Course Hero. Although na-approve ako ng April 29, I started um, answering questions ng May 1 and May 2. And yun pa lang ako nag-answer ng questions and ito na yung earnings na nakuha ko. So hindi pa ako masyadong nag-answer kasi busy pa ako with my baby but for those po na interested, so, mas marami kang questions na ma-answer, mas maraming earnings yung papasok sa account mo. And that's it. Yun po yung ways na ginawa ko para ma-prove ako agad as a course hero tutor. And para po doon sa mga nagbabalak mag-apply, just follow these four easy steps. And for sure, uh, matutulungan kayo nito para ma-approve agad as a tutor. Uh, I hope maraming kayo natutunan dito sa video na to. And... Kung gusto niyo pong i-try, wala namang mawawala. Keep on trying. Till our next video. Bye!